Let's move on. Vacuum these gold bats. Okay, was it just this heart? Oh, it's gone now. I think either dollar bills or a heart can come out of this. Oh well, let's uh, put out this fire. Wait for the smoke to disperse. Okay. So this is the tea room. And plates are gonna come out at us. Oh yeah, there's ghosts in here. Ouch. Let's uh, examine this cheese real quick. Ah, uh, get in my vacuum. Please, thank you. E. I have money to collect you, bitch. No. Okay, maybe... Okay, I don't think coins are gonna matter all that much. Come here. Okay, I think I missed my chance, actually, because I just remembered that's not the only gold mouse, because I think you can keep coming in and out of this room and a gold mouse just spawns. But, uh... Okay. We'll just... We won't worry about it now. Just worry about uh, collecting money and getting booze. So we get another ruby, so that's nice. Uh, I'll vacuum these tablecloths off. It might make it easier to find the booze. Where is he? Is he hiding in this bucket? He is, too. Jingle jangle, Mr. Boo jangles. Got him. That's 17 boos now. Yes, I love these inventions you got. I love them. I love them so much. There's a pad there that lets us walk on the ceiling. It's anti-grav Luigi. And that makes us get on, that can allow us to get on this table and open this chest. And we've found another element metal. What could it be? We have Egad to tell us. And now, Luigi, what have you found there? Let me see it. Ah, it's an ice element metal. Now you can use the ice element. Ice elemental ghosts are only found in chilly places. You'll probably find them in refrigerators and cold areas like that. My research shows that they come out of hiding when you approach. Use the L button to expel ice element once you vacuum one of these ghosts up. You press the L button all the way and you can shoot out a frigid lump of ice. Yes, sir, when water gets cold, it freezes, right? Ice can be very effective against water. You could use it on water ghosts, for example. Even a hot bath would get cold pretty quick if you iced it down. Yep, that's a very convenient item you found there, Luigi. Oh yeah. So, now this chilled bucket will allow us to get ice. We can expel ice and create ice balls. Actually, I want, I want more ice. That's two bars less than what I've had. And I think in the fridge in the kitchen downstairs, now that can spawn an ice ghost when you open it, too. Or I guess it counts as a freezer since an ice ghost comes out of it. Let's get all of these things. Oh, he was lying in... 
wait for me. What the fuck? Like, I heard him. I just assumed he disappeared. I thought he was going to be in this hallway. Like, this one over here. But I guess not. So he got mentions a hot bath. Could cool down, like, once we iced it. Oh god, no, I don't want you right now. I'll come back for him later. Oh no. It's just, uh, is this bathroom open? It is, too. Actually, let's not go in there yet. I think we want to... Ooh. You know, being a single Italian man and all, you don't get many opportunities like this. Should we, or should we respect the privacy of those who are, you know, in a shower? Nah. I am very mean. Oh god. That is... That's no lady. Ah, piping hot shower. Yeah. Forget what her name is, but let's use ice on her. And that's how you catch her. Oh god. She's so tricky to capture. She's so fat. Oh! Piece of crap. Get in my vacuum. Uh, some pearls will get stuck behind the bathtub too, but you have to kind of fish them out like this, kind of like a scoop. Not a whole lot of people know that. They just give up. And now we got another key. That goes back to the first floor. What? Okay. So there's still some ghost scenario two that we have to get. That's actually these are actually like the only two rooms left. All right. Well. Hang on, I just want to check something. Yeah. There's something I want to show off, if I can, because I think you need at least 20 or 25 booze to clear up, up this area. The cut you have just experienced is about two days later. Uh, I've come to a solution as to uh, prevent any more of that from happening. Just these sudden cuts. Um, and the solution was to purely just start emulating the game instead of like sitting in the living room and you know, just when people are gone, because people will inevitably show up back at home. So, I am now playing this on my computer. I mean, I have moved everything from the living room to, to my room, and I'm playing this on my totally legitimate GameCube. But yeah, seriously though, I don't know how, I don't know if s s Canada's still cool with that sort of thing. I know it's like practically illegal in America unless you own a copy, but I've owned my physical copy that I've used in the previous recordings for a long time. So, oh, bitch. What the hell was I doing before? 
There's still, like, stuff to take care of up here. Excuse me, I thought I caught, caught you. Things don't seem to be going my way tonight. Anyways. Here's Nana's room, and this is Nana. What do you have to say? Hey, it's a funny man. Should I play with him? Oh yes, I am so funny. Let me, like, raid your pension first. Okay. Yeah, you won't be needing that. He's guarding more of the pension! I might also be a couple... Uh, units of money richer. Besides that speedy spirit, because... There was actually a piece of cheese in the downstairs, like, dining room that... I might have scanned before... That I didn't, uh... Scan on... The actual playthrough, but I'll show off where it is later on. Let's read some of your books while we're at it. There's a moldy old journal. Yes, I will read it. What a hilarious trick I played on Miss Petunia today. She jumped into the bathtub after I filled it with ice from the freezer. Okay, so just giving you a hint on what to do with the other ghost. But Miss Petunia is made of solid stuff. She took a hot shower and felt like new again. Once she'd warmed up, she wasn't even that mad. Nana. Okay. So. That's nothing. It's like a wheel for like spinning yarn or something. Speaking of, this is what we gotta do. And she starts roaming around the room. So I guess we're just. Okay, Luigi, stop tripping on yarn for a minute. Playing a bit of pass the yarn. So we shall. We shall shoot yarn balls at you while avoiding your laser vision. And then, once you have shot all three at her, it's time to go back to the home, Granny. It's for your own good. Let me gather the, re the rest of your pension here. What about the boo? Is he guarding the rest of the pension? I highly doubt that, but... Stinky Limbooger, ew. No, you get back. You son of a bitch. Let me get the key first and then find out where he is. Shouldn't even be chasing booze, because I have something to show off that not a whole lot of people even show off anyway. Oh, well, may as well just ignore him for now. Yeah. Whatever, man. Let's go back in there. I will come back for you later. Anyways. Stop calling for Mario, Luigi. We already know where he is. Some more money, more hearts, okay. So, what room is this again? The Astral Hall. Might be thinking, some candles here to light, but what happens if you go in this door? That happens, and yeah, it's just gonna keep doing that unless you solve the puzzle. And then just step into the middle here. And now the ghosts show up. Because I'm emulating this now, of course, there might be some stutters and lag here and there, but whatever. Hmm. 
Come here, shy guy. Okay. It's a grabby ghost now. The green and red shy guys now. It's getting festive. I mean, it's still October. Kinda early, don't you think? Although I am not one that is opposed to Christmas. I mean, Luigi is himself is looking festive anyway. It says vacuum cleaner is red. The poltergust. No, I'm, I'm, I'm so used to like looking for booze. I forgot I'm supposed to be ignoring them to show off that thing. The hell, usually a gold brick pops out of this thing. Anyways, we're in the, what the hell, observatory. So, let's uh, push A on this telescope and look through it. Ooh, the stars. And the moon. Super Mario Galaxy was being foretold since this game was out, I suppose. And now we get shooting stars, or whatever. And what do we do? We have to aim it at the moon. We gotta shoot for the moon. And the aiming is kinda wonky. Cause you're probably not aiming for exactly what you're aiming for. See how, even though it looked like I was dead on, I was actually way off. What about here? Nope, still way off. Takes a couple tries. No. I'll get it. I'll get it eventually. What about right there? Fuck, still. Yeah! Are you serious? Come on. Oh. 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 Nope. Son of a bitch. Okay, there we go. I got it. Ooh. The cosmic road to the power star it is beautiful. Okay. Let's uh, grab the star then. You found Mario's star. My, what a glittering beauty. I have we push the map here. We're out of bounds. You can barely see Luigi out there. I think if you push here, you can... Nope. Still not quite. What about here? Meh. Okay. Yeah, now, now he is out of bounds. Where he's reachable. But time to go back inbounds. I don't think there is much to do up here now. Not really. Well, on the other side, which we actually have to go back downstairs to get to, there's a room over there. There's a room on the second floor. Or first floor, excuse me. So, I don't know, let's just go find a mirror to look in or something. <laughs> 